<laughs> what is going on guys and guys YouTube it is wise dad and we are back again today different game man uh, I still I'm still doing the smart thing I'm um, also uh, I got back into Conan because there was a huge freaking update today you're gonna see me attempt to level up one of my fighters um, he's not a named if you have played Conan I know you're wasting your time blah 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 but hey every little bit helps man every freaking little bit helps so what we're gonna do is we're gonna swim across the lake here we're gonna find some good old birds and some alligators to go ahead and fight to see if we can't level him up super quick ah uh, there is panthers we we can take the panthers i believe does he have food do you have food sir sir do you, you have 11 fish uh i have been playing this for a minute just trying to get my feet on the ground, you know, get established. Is that a person? No, I don't, I don't know what that is. I do see two over there. We cannot take two at a time. That's not us. Get. What do you have? What weapon? Do you have the steel ones? Do you have the iron ones? I thought I made you steal. Oh, I gave them to the other guy. No. Well, that's not good. But we should be okay. Let's see if we can pull one at a time. Let's get behind this one. I heard him growl, so he's going to be coming. I do see him. He's in fight stance. Please come. I don't want to come up there. No, oh, piss on it. We're going to go down. We'll make him bleed real quick, and then we'll just hit the other one. So, my favorite weapon in this game is the daggers. I think they are fantastic. Of course, the update has bugs. Every new update does. It is what it is. They're going to have to fix a few things. I don't have my skin and knife out. Because I have enough meat cooked already. Let's get this guy down. See, he really does hurt. He actually gives you bleed. Which I should probably find a baby one of these and go ahead and put it in my pen. That'd be pretty cool. Nice. I don't want to waste the meat. Uh, let's get rid of the pickaxe for right now. On the hot bar. You gotta have the tools on your hot bar. You have to have them. Where'd the other one go? He's right here. We'll skin him real quick. We'll get the feral flesh. I thought they would give me savory flesh, but they don't. That's okay. We have plenty of meat. I'm just trying... Oh. No. Okay. No, I hear one. So he's in fight stance. I don't really know if he wants to come after us. Let's just... Yep, he does. Ugh, freaking surprise attacks all the time. So all I'm trying to do is level up my fighter behind me. Once he gets leveled up, he can do a lot of damage. Nope, we're going to dodge that. Let's go ahead and cut him up a little bit to give him some support. We'll let him finish him. We'll back out of the way. You don't have to... You didn't have to backflip, bro. It's not that serious. You're taking too long, so I'm going to go ahead and finish them off for you. Get the skin and knife out. Let's go ahead and get some meat. Uh, we do not have berserkers yet. If you guys don't know what that is, they are the best fighters so far in the game, except for the named fighters when you take slaves. I do have some slaves. I don't have a lot. I do have one named one, but he's not done yet. He's on the Wheel of Pain. Man, if you guys haven't checked this game out yet, you you need to. I mean, it it's super worth the money. If it still costs anything, I think it was $30 when I bought it like two years ago. The only reason I quit playing it is because there was an Alpha Squad, and we just kept getting wiped, and I got tired of getting wiped. But I'm in a pretty good... Oh, I have the skin knife out. I'm in a pretty good group now. I don't think... I think if I get wiped, then 
whoever wipes me is going to get definitely wiped. There we go. He leveled up one. I know these guys give us savory flesh. There's like it's like steaks. But you have. I'll show you guys in just a second. I'll show you the the wheel. We'll get this bird, and then I'll show you guys the wheel. And all you can do. So we're doing. We're doing a lot of damage to them, but these birds actually do hurt sometimes. Be careful. Get the skin and knife out. Let's go ahead and skin that. So this is pretty much a game of knowledge and attributes. So anything red I cannot unlock yet. Right? And there's just so much that you can unlock. It is absolutely ridiculous at the amount of stuff that you can do. Is that the steel hatchet? I probably do need to get that. Combination of a hatchet and a pick for cutting stone and harvesting wood. Yeah, we're going to buy that. Improved fireball cauldron. Dismantling bench. I don't need that. No, beer. Don't need that. Have plenty of it here. What is that thing? Armored animal pen. That seems like a waste. But... You can you can literally pick what you want to do. You can do your weapons. You can do anything you want. So there's a common thin blade double edged sword. Does 27 damage. What's this one do? 33. We're getting attacked by something. It was a rabbit. Get the hell out of here. So if you go to your tributes, here's your tribute tree, right? So if you look to your right, each each five levels gives you a bonus. So this one gives us heavy and special attack, deal 10% more. That's on strength. Agility will give us deal 15% increased damage when attacking from behind. We do that a lot because I like to play with daggers. I'm trying to get the authority tapped out because the authority at the very bottom, it says War Party, maximize your, maximize your followers by one. However, your statistics no longer influence your followers' damage output. That is not a bad one to cap. But you only get so many of these, right? You don't, you can't cap all these out. You can fully cap out two. And I think I'm going to work on authority, and then go expertise, and then whatever I have left, I'm either going to pump into vitality or I'm going to do strength. I don't know yet. It's a very hard decision. It is just <laughs> something that we're going to have to deal with. But that's the trees. That's what we are working towards. Also working towards better weapons. You know, star metal. Which is a whole other topic. We're literally at the starting edge of it right now. Trying to get these little fellas leveled up. They can go to level 20. Let's skin him. This guy's probably level 7 now, I think. But also have a challenge to kill the birds. You do get da daily challenges. Some of them are ridiculous. Some of them are super easy. I find the bird one not too bad because I was going to come out here anyway and kill something to level him up. And I think we're out of birds. I think we're going to start running into crocodiles and salamanders. I know that sounds silly, but these salamanders are freaking deadly, man. <clears throat> and uh, if you're starting out in this game and you're new and you don't know what to do, don't get frustrated, man. You're, you're going to die. I mean, that's a given. You are going to die. And when you die, you lose everything unless you can get to your body. If you can get to your body, that is awesome. If you can't, it sucks. I know. Or if you die again, you don't get it back. But it is what it is. Right? You gotta take it in heaps. It's kind of... I hate to compare it to it, but it's kind of like Ark. It's like Ark in a lot of ways. But in my opinion, this one's better. You don't have somebody on a freaking Giga coming to wreck your base. Like, if they're gonna wreck your base, they're gonna do it by hand. And it's going to take them some time. We're not going to even worry about skinning him. I have plenty of that. This guy's hostile though. All the gray ones are. He will attack me. Yeah. 
Nice. We will cut them up, though, because that's, of course, savory flesh. And hide. Oh, is this a shipwreck I've not discovered yet? I believe it is. Let's go check this out real quick. Oh, there's a camp. Where am I? I am not far from home at all. Oh, I know what that camp is. I've just not been to this. Uh, there's nothing in it. Let's go ahead and eat. Because this camp coming up is really hard. I usually go in here when I'm looking for people to take back to try to make my own. The slaves and whatnot. This is... God dang it, I got those damn skin and knife out. I'm gonna get back from that. Get out of the wall, please. We'll kill him, and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take his... We'll take that, and that, and that. Give me your primary weapon, and take a bludgeon. So we'll do that, and then we'll give him the bludgeon. What the bludgeon does is it knocks people out. This guy right here is usually a level 3 fighter. We'll have to see. I'm not sure what he is right now. He's a level 2. I mean, we'll take him. We don't have to. As long as dude's tanking it, it's fine. Get out of that. If he starts taking too much damage, we'll definitely back out. He's doing a pretty good job at blocking the attacks, though. I just ate that. Last time I was in here, this was a named fighter. Which is kind of discouraging, knowing that it changed. Okay, he's unconscious now. He's in the water, so we kind of got to move a little faster. You attach the rope, you run back home. The rope can break, keep in mind. Oh, there's an alligator somewhere over there. And I gave... My dude still has the bludgeon on. That's not the best move. You probably need to put his blades back on before you start the run back home. It is what it is. This is the hand we're dealt right now. It's not horrible, though. I mean, we'll, we'll take a level two. Even if he is trash, we level him up, and all he does is stand guard in the base when somebody attacks us. They're going to be like, oh, who is that? Who is that? It buys us time. For when we can actually get over there. Which, what I did is my... The clan that I'm with, I've been playing with Conan for about a year and a half now. We were in different clans. We decided to merge. And they're built far away from me. I'm so low over here. But I know if something goes really, really south, then they will be there for me. We need to keep going straight. This side, or that, it doesn't matter. Okay, yeah, I know where I'm at. There's uh, another clan here. I haven't talked to them, but I feel like they've been attacked because their stuff's open. So I've only been playing this for about two days again, trying to get back in the groove of it. Your biggest thing is you're going to start out shitty, man. Oh, no. The rope binding broke. I have another one, though. Boom. What? No, get that out of there. Drop. Take. Do something. All right, it's gone. To be honest, that rope binding has lasted us a very long time. Can I not drag him? There we go. We got him again. But I know if something happens to me, then the clan's going to respond. And that's what I like, man. 
That is exactly what I like. I just like doing stuff on my own, and they understand that. Kind of looks like my door's open. Is it open? Oh, no, that's the edge of my stables. I got worried there for a minute and thought somebody had done hit me. This game is super user friendly. It is a really good game. No dinosaurs, nothing like that. You can tame horses and panthers and whatnot to guard your house. There's my horse. He gets around pretty fast. Why is all my wheels of pain stopped? That's not good. So what you do is whenever you capture somebody, you're going to put them on a wheel of pain. I know this one's free for a fact. We're going to have to put some meat in there for him to go. And boom. I always check back because they have meat in their pockets. And when the meat is in their pockets, they stop when they run out. So that guy had eight... Eight minutes and 51 seconds. Why are you stopped? Are you... F you're not done? Don't stop, bro. Nothing's in here. You're getting close. That's an armor. He's the name fighter. So what you do is you pretty much kidnap these people. And you make them your slave. Did I say it was right? No. Did not. It's not right. It is what it is. But that's the game, man. Oh, he's in the house. Come on, everybody. Mess him up. Mess him up. I built on a snake spawn. That's why he's in here. How did I die? Are you guys going to be able to get him? Please get him. Oh, that's not good. That is not good at all. You were killed by a snake, I know. Do I open the door? Oh! Who's dead? There's a lot of people dead. Where's my stuff? Loot all. Get back in the fight. Oh, where's my daggers? No, I'm about to lose all my fighters right now. This is ridiculous, man. He's dead. He's dead. I just lost every fighter I had. I knew I should have put the blades back on him. That's my fault. He even had the good blades on him and still died. Oh, that's so bad. So all the work from leveling up everything is just gone. You're going to run into that. It's very, very unfortunate. <sighs> That's why I said I don't care what level they are. As long as they're in the house and just doing their thing. So that's going to be us for the next little bit. We're going to be getting more and more fighters. Knocking them out. Bringing them back. To at least <laughs> make sure this is safe. <laughs> if I can't make my base safe, I don't know what I'm going to do in this game. The snake usually doesn't even spawn in here. It's only happened like three times. Which is still three too much. I don't know. That, that's disheartening. Disheartening. It hurts. So we need to put the feline pelt up in the tanner's table here. I think I have Reptile Hide, too. Not seeing it. All I see is a bunch of damn gear. Let's go over here to the Tanner and give him the leather. Or the hide to make into leather. He takes oil to do that. And I believe that's going to do it for us, guys. That just really took the wind out of my sails. But if you like what you see, please hit that subscribe button. Man, much love is appreciated. We're going to be on Conan for a little bit. We're also going to be back and forth between Smite and PUBG. But, hey, let me know what you guys want to see. Till next time, guys. You guys stay safe. Love you.